So hi everybody, it's Tuesday. I just got back from doing some grocery shopping, but I had my boobies squished. It was mammogram day. Uh, usually I have it done in October, which is, as you probably are already aware, um, breast cancer month. And I was late this year getting it done but it's done. And the woman told me that it was my 35th mammogram. I can't believe it's been that many. 35. Um, anyway, if you haven't done it and you're older than 40 and you're a woman, go get squished. I made this blanket for my stepdaughter. I'm not going to unfold it, but it's big and I made that. It's her Christmas present. And I stopped and got myself some new yarn. Misty Alpaca. It's chunky. It's going to make a cowl which of course I will show you when it's done. And it's already doing something that I'm not too fond of. I was wearing a black fleece jacket and didn't take a bag when I bought it. And my jacket's covered in like white dog hairs. Obviously it's not dog, but it's alpaca. And alpaca seems to shed. We'll see. Anyway, I it's, oh, very soft. I made a list of things to talk to you about because I missed yesterday. Oh well, as you know, I have never committed to a bed fam. Ever. I'm just here. Um, I dreamed last night. I dreamed, first of all, about Gigi, and there was Gigi's little face with her little red hairs and her big earnest eyes talking to me about vitamin pills, and she had a stash like a small mountain, like I'm not talking about on a tabletop where you heap up something into a little mountain, I'm talking about a mountain of vitamin pills that she had all stashed out. Would she give me any to try? No. Very unlike Gigi, I'll tell you that. I think Gigi, if I really needed it, would give me the shirt off her back. She's that type of young woman. But she wouldn't give up an omega-3 pill, which, by the way, I purchased, and I have stopped taking them because they taste foul. They make me burp. I didn't like it. Pat's taking them. And they're good for him. I also dreamed of all things. I've dreamed, I've dreamed, as you know, about YouTube people before. I've dreamed, I dream about Beth quite regularly, or at least when she was vlogging every day, quite regularly. So she would say something that would trigger a dream for me. I've dreamt about uh, Robo Gore-Tex, who isn't Robo Gore-Tex anymore. The alpaca is making me... F um, so, you know, it's usual for me to have a dream about a YouTube person. But I dreamed of all things the Queen of England. And somehow we were related, like, I don't know, second cousins. But I thought of her as my grandmother. And we were sharing some tea and I took her outside and showed her how to make a snowball and she gave me a mink jacket. That's what I woke up with this morning um, and I thought that that was pretty unusual. It stayed with me too. Normally my dreams are just poof, gone. Um, if I try to remember them they're just gone, gone, gone. But there you go. I have a mink stole. No, it wasn't a stole. It was a jacket. 
little mink, mink jacket, soft and lovely, from the Queen of England, Elizabeth. We saw Armitage the other day. Uh, it's got Richard Gere in, and he was extraordinary. Um, it's it's sort of a typical story, you know, about the rich uh, businessman stealing from everybody and getting away with it. But he he was extraordinary. He did a great job in the movie. If you see it or can rent it or download it or whatever it is that you do to watch movies, it was pretty good. And we're going to go on Thursday to see Skyfall Bond. I'm not a big Bond fan, but Daniel Craig, his first two James Bond movies were, I thought, very good. Of course, it could be Daniel Craig. Daniel Craig in that blue bathing suit, when he came out of the water in the first, in his first James Bond movie, mm -hmm. it's something to see, I'll tell you. But anyway, that's what we're going to do. And last thing, I had breakfast with Vienna. Christopher called from Hong Kong. Uh, it was 7.30 at night here. I was just having my cup of hot green tea. And there's Vienna just waking up, having her breakfast. And we chatted sort of for, I don't know, 45, 45 minutes to an hour on Skype. It was lovely. She had yogurt and toast and mango. Mango? Mango, I think. It was great to see her. Okay, that's it, that's all.